Hey guys, it's Inigo, and uh, I did not plan to do this video at all, and uh, there's a pretty big chance that you will never see this, but if you do, hey guys. Uh, I just ordered some food and I was like, I could just eat this, or I could eat this with you guys here, <laughs> I guess. So yeah, I don't know if you can see this properly, I'm using my webcam, which I used for over a year, I think, for my video, so, um, but yeah, this is just some, uh, udon noodles with, um, bell peppers and, what else, tofu, and, And it's got a um, sort of like a garlic black pepper sauce dressing, whatever you want to call it. And it's got some dried onions on it as well. So let's see. I normally am pretty decent with um, chopsticks, but whenever I'm on camera, I'm really bad. So there you go. Kind of weird to like eat on camera anyway. Mm. And I also told myself that I would never in my life do a um, mukbang video, which is like an eating show video. Which I think is weird. Well, I don't think it's weird, weird, but it's like it's like a strange culture behind it. That I'm not sure if I wanna. Be, be with. Mm. But I do promote healthy eating. And um, this is. You know, me eating vegetarian, <laughs> as I do always. So I figured I could just share that. I don't know. I'm being really weird. I'm gonna change the camera position or the microphone position halfway through. And cut it on. And it'll just go in this here mostly. So. to home cook generally, but having a bit of a, a rough start up today, so I'm like behind on pretty much everything. And I have a live stream for Patreon in an hour, so I just ordered some, something to eat. Mm. I really love the noodles. I love this place. You can just kind of like make your own, you know, noodles with like a menu of like all sorts of ingredients you can add. Probably not gonna finish the whole thing. My appetite's always kind of up and down. I like to eat, but some days I just. Since, like, when I order food, I always have leftovers. 
and then I'll just I eat them the next day for dinner or if it's not that much for lunch. And there's this Indian place that I always order at and um And they give you so much food that no matter what I order, I'm gonna be able to eat from that for two days to the point where I'm like so full I'm, I slip into a food coma. <laughs> See, I'm a pretty messy eater. My mom tried to teach me table manners, but I never really stuck, so. Mm -hmm. I really, I really love yeah, Indian food. It's really my favorite at the moment, anyway. Mm. It's just, if you're vegan or vegetarian, if you eat Indian food, it's just so many carbs. <laughs> so like potato this, potato that, non bread, stuff like that. It's really yummy, but so many carbs. <laughs> Fine, I mean, carbs are good for you, but you know, you do need your proteins as well. And your veggies. And when you eat vegetarian, especially if you eat vegan, it can be really hard to, uh, To, like not get enough, not get too much carbs, because it's just so tempting to eat all carbs. <laughs> mm -hmm. And I tried full vegan for a while, but it was really hard for me to get all my needed protein really so for now I am like I eat like a veg vegetarian diet but I don't really drink milk um I have like almond milk with my cereal and stuff like that and I don't use almond milk in ingredients or as an ingredient in like recipes as well instead of milk but I won't like I won't shun like anything that has everything that has like milk as an ingredient or something, but I just kind of like don't have a, a lot of it. I've actually noticed now that I'm mm, consuming less dairy, which I do really think that dairy is bad for the human body, but it's just really hard not to because <laughs> it's also very delicious. Mm. I've kind of found that it's like a weird aftertaste if you don't have that much of it, but I don't know. I didn't come here to like lecture you on food. <laughs> just, just eating them, I guess. But this is very delicious. Mm. I used to be like a massive meat eater. I was obsessed with meat. Mm. So I thought it would be really hard for me to stop eating it. Because I decided I was going to be vegan. But that didn't really work out. But vegetarian, I guess, over a year ago. And it's been super easy, actually. I find that a lot of meat substitutes are actually it's really delicious. I mm, don't really miss it all that much. Like, I'm like, 
Much stuff right there. <laughs> hmm. But like I said, my appetite isn't massive today, so. Mm I went up from hmm? touch up my makeup after I eat because I got it everywhere for some reason. I'm not very smart. <laughs> I do have some more food. But let me just see if I can switch up my microphone. Ta da! <laughs> okay. So, I should really have this like the next day, but I always get some. smaller cheese filled spring rolls. These are very yummy. Like one of those things that's like a little bit too good, so. Anyway. I let them sit in the container which had aluminum foil on it. Well, it's are like a little bit soft, but it's okay. And it just comes with this sweet chili and depthy. I feel like such a nerd doing one of these. Mm. I'm trying, I'm really trying to be like a decent human being here, but you might notice that I eat very fast, which I don't know. Did you bring a little Oh, I just. as if like the war is gonna break
water and wash my hands, but not today. <laughs> what I do always tend to do after eating is have a bit of a vape, even though I don't use nicotine in mine. I'm just kind of a habit, you know. I hope you enjoyed this very um, impromptu video that I didn't plan at all. Mm. I was actually planning to never do it all, but here you go. Thank you so much.